Hi, I'm going to talk about um, gifts to students or staff and all the rules that come along with that. As far as gifts to students, um, gifts can be paid for with activity funds that are appropriate. Um, so we aren't going to pay for volleyball gifts with football funds and such. Um, they can be given as incentives for fundraising events or as awards for special achievements. As far as incentives for fundraising events, um, it should only be given to students who actually participated. Um, prizes have to be age appropriate and of reasonable cost, and they should be purchased from the particular activity fund for which the students are raising money. As far as special achievement gifts, awards again have to be age appropriate and reasonable cost. Um, sometimes they can come from a general fund or donations from businesses or parent groups. Or if it's a sports team, it can come from the athletic fund. And then anytime you're purchasing gifts for students or staff, um, we have to keep public opinion in mind. And we want to make sure we aren't being, we don't appear as lavish or anything like that. And um, as far as gifts to staff, they should be reasonably priced. Um, these are usually paid for with staff remembrance funds, and it usually comes from annual dues and staff donations, and it should be managed by a committee that meets to review the guidelines of spending. At the school that I was at, we had a social committee, and they were the ones who oversaw the collection of the monies and how they were spent for desks, bursts, um, teacher appreciation, those kinds of things. As far as gifts to community members, if some special occasion warrants a gift, um, the best approach that was noted in my documentation was to ask a parent organization to coordinate a benefit event. Some things to remember along with the gift giving Always keep public opinion in mind. Again, um, we want to make sure that our funds are used wisely, that we aren't giving extravagant, extravagant gifts, those kinds of things. We need to follow the procedural guidelines to ensure correct accountability, make sure they're coming from the right funds, um, going to the people they're supposed to, those kinds of things, and then avoid the appearance of poor judgment. We don't want to buy gifts because we all had a good day yesterday. Those kinds of things. It should be a special event. And again, for the certain group that the money has come from. So purchase gifts and give gifts wisely.